Hi everybody, it's Denise with Wonder Bar Crafts. Today um, is Super Bowl Sunday, yay! <laughs> and no, I'm not watching the Super Bowl. I know a lot of people are like, ah, ah, but the Chiefs are playing. The Chiefs are in it. Yeah, okay. I, I'm just not a football fan. I'm sorry, I'm just not. I'm not, never been really, I mean, I'll watch it. I like the commercials more than anything, and I can go back later and watch those, because those will be all on YouTube or whatever, you know, so... But anyways, what I want to do today is try and do some last couple projects that, uh, and finish up this Valentine's journal. Um, I've already done some decorating in it and filled with some cards and stuff like that. Um, but what I wanted to do was this little project here, make, using one of the avocado dyed CD cases. Now this one, when I, when I dyed it, it did come apart, which is, I guess, pretty unusual because normally they they were not coming apart at all so um but anyways I want to make an, a cute little window card or something you know um not even a not really even a it can be used as a greeting card but I preferably like you know intended as a journaling card so it'll go in there and I've already pre-cut my card um let's see it's a long card, so I cut it at four and three quarters by nine and a half, and then just scored it down the middle to make a little card. Um, so, oh boy, how's everybody doing? Good, I hope. Um, sorry I haven't had a video in the last couple days. Uh, I don't know if you remember from my last um video I went to the dentist and then we had like a last minute change of plan to um I'm having an implant put in so we had a we had an opening come open and I wanted to take advantage of it because I've been waiting to try and get in and he is like months to get in so I was like no I'm taking it <laughs> so you know instead of having uh a brain full of marbles I had a mouth full of marbles and I don't think I would have been able to be very clear, not that I'm ever really, ever really clear on my videos, sometimes I mumble, I know. <laughs> but anyways, um, so I guess we could get started. What I was thinking is, I'd like to, this came from Crafty Cat's um, digital uh, love notes, and what I kind of want to do is center that so that it, you know, is right there on that window, but I want to obviously decorate the card and all that stuff so I don't want to make it too thick mm, let's see I was thinking uh, I like her lace on her but I don't know if that's gonna be big enough oh it might be we could leave like a little frame here so let me doesn't have to be anything elaborate because the picture is going to go over it and then we'll decorate the front on that so <sighs> I'm sure some of you may be doing your um, Super Bowl parties and all the goodies and munchies and snacks my niece they're having um, people over they live in Kansas City and she said they're having a bunch of people over. I'm doing their own little party. And I said, have fun with that. Not I. Not I, child. Not I. <laughs> so. Okay. I don't want to make this come in a little bit. So. Get that straight. I like this lace background. I like the I love the color it printed out. I don't know if that is the color of the lace or if she just did not like a nice background behind it, but it's beautiful. I love it. Okay. And then
like so. Yeah, I've never been a real football. I like hockey. <laughs> I know, right? Hockey. <laughs> I don't know. I just, I think it takes a lot of talent to get out there on the ice, on ice skates, on those two little thin blades, and, you know, let alone ice skate. And then, you know, um, because I, I have ice, I have done some ice skating in my day when I was younger. Um, and it's it's already difficult. And then to to play a game on top of it, oof, it takes a lot of talent. It really does. And not to say that football players don't have talent, because I know they do. A lot of them, geez, to run all that, oof. Catch a ball, throw a ball, punt a ball, do all that stuff. No. Alright. Just gonna go ahead and ink this real quick since my ink is out and I have to re-ink it or do whatever, but it's okay. already inked that so what I'm thinking is put that on there and then put that there and maybe do some more decorating yeah 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 I since uh, I couldn't really do too much talking I've been working a lot on this journal I got the pen case done I got the zipper pouch done Get it all filled with goodies and all that. And I was like, well, I want to finish it all the way up. I still have to sew the signatures in, obviously. Signatures are still here. But I wanted to make sure before I sewed them in um, if I needed to do any more sewing. Because once you sew them into, you can't exactly take them out and run them under the sewing machines. <laughs> I mean, if you're really talented, I suppose you could, but. I am not that talented. Okay. And then I was thinking of this. And I think I want to use these like like right there. I think that would be pretty. So <laughs> what do we want to do? Think, think, think. Maybe we could do a little stamping on it or something. Uh, a little heart. No. Oh, I don't know. Hmm. Oh. Now I have paper doily that I got from my friend Allie and maybe what we can do is take a corner piece of this right there give a little ink that and then let's see she also sent me this really pretty paper but it's kind of shiny I don't know if it would go okay with that oh I've got this music it's pink Maybe we could put a little piece on there. That's a printout from Digital Curio, if you're curious. Um, let's see. Huh. 
Oh, the weather is beautiful today. We're supposed to get up to 60. So all the snow is melting. And then um, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, we're supposed to get more snow. <laughs> I like really something like that and then it needs something else what else what else what else um well it's pretty washy but nothing is really let's see speaking at me speak to me speak to me this one's kind of pretty because it's it's got a little red in it. And maybe what we can do is put that down at the bottom there, I think. So let's do that real quick. And then maybe I'll throw a little piece of lace or something pretty like that. Oh, you know what? I've got all these little hearts that my friend... Amy, Crafty Cat, sent me. She sent me some happy mail like last year. It has a ton of different little hearts in there. So maybe we can put, add something, find something in there. Um, let's see. I don't want to cover up that nice rough edge. I'm thinking right there. I'm sorry, I gotta reach across. back on I can get it over the top yeah I haven't taken them out of the boxes yet I still I have like washi tape little dispensers that I keep all my washi in and tubs and <laughs> yeah I like washi <laughs> And this washi is pretty good. It's got it's got a really uh, strong um, tack to it, but I still put the glue on there. I think just mainly out of habit. There, and then I'll put. I gotta make sure she's gonna be be able to be seen in there, right? Because. That's the whole point. Okay, I kind of want her centered. That. Add in a little bit. <clears throat> oh, I kind of like it like that. It's quite pretty. Oh, let's see. Can we? Can we? Can we? Should we? Nah. Don't overdo it. So. Let's tack down some stuff over here. Push down too much because if I need to move that, I can because it'll stay sticky for for a few. There goes my neighbor dog. He's crying. He wants to come in. <laughs> Poor fella. Poor fella. Oh, look at that. Came out pretty good. All right. So, we can put that down a little bit. And I may sew around the card. I don't think 
think I'm going to decorate too, too much on it because oh. oh, where's my eraser? Ooh. glue picked up a little bit. There we go. There we go. Awesome. Okay. It will slide in there like so, and then I was thinking, I don't really want that. I think that's upside down. I put it up here. I'm not really that upside down or right side up? No, I think that's right side up because the, there is a rose there. All right, so maybe that's going there. All right, I think that'll look good. And then I think I'm just going to leave this blank for journaling space in here. Okay, so we got ourselves a nice little card in here. So let's. glue this portion back down. I have had an overwhelming uh, request for um, more of those packs, the Valentine's packs. Um, I am just about done uh, with my taxes. I've got all of the numbers. <laughs> Um, figured out. Now all I have to do is actually do the taxes. Um, once that's done and I get this journal finished, then I will do another die. So, because at least I know then that, um, well, goodness, that, uh, Everything is, is, you know, up to sniff. <laughs> All right, so that's what I want to do there. And I will probably make a few. I'm not going to make a bunch of those packs. I'll make a few, but I will also have... Um, and the reason why I can only do a few is I'll only have a few of those little free gift with purchase um, packs left. Um, I'm not going to do pre-orders on them. The only reason why is I don't like to say, yes, I'm going to do it. And then life happens, you know. So doing a pre-order for something like that. Well, I mean, if it was just one or two or something. I would be okay, but to do that many, life does happen, and I don't want to be um, pro making a promise I, I can't, you know what I'm saying, because life does happen. Not to say that it, I wouldn't do it, I would do it of my, if it was absolutely possible, you know, I'm going to do it, but life happens, <laughs> so, uh I won't, I'm not going to do pre, uh, I'm not going to do pre-orders on them, um, because of that reason. So, uh, but I'm going to have some other packs. They'll be smaller. I think what I'll do is, um, when I do my next die, I'm not going to put 
single sheets and stuff like that in there um, at first. I, I will eventually put those back in the shop, but I think what I'm going to do is make up some packs. I'll have some of the big packs like the Valentines. Then I'll have some other ones that are smaller, and then they have some different stuff in them. Um, and then I might do like a, a envelope pack where it'll have just a bunch of different kind of envelopes. It won't be the standard three sizes that I have. It'll be some other stuff too, but I got to figure out what I have in stock um, to, um, oh, I like that there, to make sure that, you know, I can, because I, I don't want to say, oh, I'm going to have 10 of these packs and I'm short, so because of what I have in stock. All right. I like that little rose back there as a little tuck to tuck the, the top open, right? But I don't know if I want it that, because I want to be able to tuck it down in there. So we'll just kind of put it maybe like right there. Thinking. I don't know why I put my lid back on because I'm still using it. <laughs> it's probably down a little bit, but that's okay. So I'm going to have clearance for that flap. is you know, a little bit of glue on something and you could end up with a big mess. Okay. Time. All right. All right. So I'm thinking it still needs a little something something on there, right? Because what I want to do is, I don't want to make it too thick, obviously. Um, I'm going to I'm gonna put it here so that it's attached to this page here. So, well, maybe, should I go that way with it? So you can open it, yeah, open it up and out. I'm thinking, well, but if I do it this way, you can open it up and out, and then you can see it. So that's kind of where I want to kind of go with it. Um, maybe I should put a little lace on the top up here. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. What do I got? What do I got? What do I got? Watch out. Boobies, watch out. Okay, hold on. Let me find a little piece of something. Oh, actually, this won't stick out too bad. And I think it's pretty. This is just a uh, Hobby Lobby. Just put that over the top, I think. And... Then, maybe put a little flower or something up there. Yeah, I kind of stunk because I, I was hoping to do a couple more videos, but... <sighs> Can't always get what we want, right? Isn't that a song? Part of a song. Is that a Rolling Stones or something, I think? 
<laughs> Show my age. <laughs> All right, so let's see. Let's put... I was going to put some flowers with the... I like these flowers because they have little pearls. You know. Maybe one there. One on the pink. Whew, it's warm up here because um, my heat is on in the house. I don't want to turn it off for just one day because later tonight it'll probably drop. And let's see. Side, or do we want it over here on this side? Mm, I kind of like it over here on the left side. I don't know why I'm not a lefty. <laughs> you know? Okay. Or maybe we should put little white ones instead of a big white one. Wherever my little white ones are, they keep falling out of the pack. I think I got a little, saying I will bust in the side of the thing here. <laughs> so they're popping out of the... Um, like it or should we do two smaller red and a bigger white I don't know see decisions decisions you're just like make up your mind Denise hurry up oh my neighbor dog is mad at something <laughs> smaller and a larger white there. Oh, I kind of like that better because then it's not so big and bulky, right? Yeah. Yeah. So that's what we're going to do. <laughs> You're like, thank goodness she made up her mind. These ones back. See, he's mad about something. Whew. Somebody must be out there playing or walking by the yard or something out there. He's a big old German Shepherd. He's a sweetheart. I mean, he's gotten loose a couple times and he comes over to the yard over here and investigates and sniffs everything out. And he's been, you know, I've gone out there and go on, you know, and he. Doesn't bark at me or anything, you know. Because my dogs will go absolutely crazy because if he sees them in the yard, they're like, uh, no, our yard, our domain, stay out of it. There we go. All right. So. I think what I want to do is uh, sew around this card while this envelope dries a little bit. And I'm just going to give it a quick zip around. I'm not going to turn the camera on for it. I'm just going to go run and do that real quick and I will be right back. Okay, so all I did was just sew it around the edge, straight stitch. 
Let them dance expanding. Okay. And then what I want to do is all right, let's take this page out so I can work with it a little bit. And uh, what I did was kind of dress the other side with just a little, it's just intended to flip open a little bit of lace on there. And then I think what I want to do is glue it so that the heart meets up there. So I think we'll just get the fabric tag on this to make sure it stays down onto the page after I glue, because uh, I'm going to have to uh, sew that in with the signature in because I don't want to try and glue this later. My luck, it would be all um, jacked up. <laughs> I'd glue it to something else, you know. So, just better I do it now. Alright, so let's see, about even, top and bottom, pretty close. Let's see if we can get it right to the edge of that heart there. Yeah, I did my fingernails too, because, you know, couldn't do anything else. And then started working with the Fabri-Tac, and all my fingernail polish was coming off. Started peeling off. Like, oh yeah, acetone. <laughs> fingernail polish. Don't mix. So, I had to take it all off. <laughs> okay. All right, so there is that. Just kind of barely pokes out there along with the lace so it fits in there just nice and nice and neatly with the this is the other side here all right so then what I want to do is do we have time oh we might let's just go ahead this down pop that over there okay and I don't even need that and this other signature what I was thinking this one might be a little more elaborate, but mm -hmm. <laughs> where is it at? Where is it at? I have another page that is like that, that I flipped out. You know, it's got lace on it. Flips out. Um, and I went ahead and decorated this with washi, <clears throat> but um, what I want to do is this is a page from uh, Medieval Mirage. I think this is Illuminated Flora. If I'm not mistaken. Okay. Oh, I forgot to use the little hearts. Oh, I can go back. What I want to do is um, kind of just have like an open pocket here. Uh, but I, I don't know if I want it on this side. I don't want to cover up the washi. I like the washi there. So... What I was thinking is having a little um, lace or something, you know. So, let's see, where's my big, big one? Two inch. So, I want to put a little thumb 
piece in here and I think you know, I want to do it on both sides that way and get to it from either side whether it's open from the left or the right Let's see if I can get this in here about even there we go and <clears throat> sorry What I'm thinking, and I hope it comes to life, <laughs> I've got some very, very pretty um, wedding dress type um, lace and then some other lace that I want to use because it's been sitting in my drawer and I keep saying, I need to use that. I need to use that. I bought it for a reason. I need to use it. So the side that I want... Um, And that's what I'm trying to, I guess, figure out. If I put it on this side, it's you're not going to see it. It's going to flap over. So what I was thinking. Is that right side up? Okay, here we go. Is <clears throat> if I can get it straight and in the camera. Putting this piece here. Probably glue it down and then sew it. Um, do I want the other end? Kind of like that in the center a little bit. And then um, on the other side, I want to put some of this on it. So it's kind of like a little lacy pouch, but you can still see the beautiful decoration. See, because I was thinking this will, uh, it doesn't quite, you know, it's not going to get covered up too much. So, but then I have the finger flap in there so you can kind of, the lace will be kind of covering it a little bit, but the finger tab, you'd still be able to get in there and put some, something in there. You know what I mean? So let's do that. Oh, uh, come on. All right, so kind of center that. Thinking this piece could probably come down just a smidgen so you can get to the finger tab, right? Because it kind of V's right there and so cut a piece of this off <clears throat> I can always turn it down even more if I need and let's see I think if I just tack it down there and then uh, just run the stitch, you know, over it. It should be all right. I'm hoping. <laughs> I'm hoping. So, <clears throat> use a little bit of the art glitter glue because it works pretty good on fabric with paper. And this is pretty in intricate. But I think if we dop it down a little bit here and there, it'll hold it in place pretty good. Without it getting too, too messy through the, um, Come on, brain work. <clears throat> um, the tool that's you know it's it's designed on too. So yep. I 
just going to put a couple little dot, dots there because I don't want it to soak through too much. Ooh, this might have been a little bit bigger project than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> oh, I'll just tack it on and sew it. Alright. It'll be quick. Because I don't want my glue to set up either, you know. Although, uh, this seems that art glitter glue seems to um, stay fairly wet. You know, it'll dry once it, it, it it's like it touches the other, uh, the paper, and then it starts to dry really well. But sometimes you it gets soaked in. And... We don't want that. All right. Ta-da! Okay, I'm pulling it off here just so I can pick it up. And I know I'm going to need to trim those edges, but... I'm thinking I'm probably gonna have to change my thread because I don't know. I don't know if the pink pink might look good actually through it. Might not be too bad. We'll see when we get to that point. Okay, and then I want a piece of this to kind of run. You'll still be able to get to the finger tab there. That's why I wanted to put it on both sides. That way you can still kind of get in there. All right, let's make sure we're on the right side here. Okay. Oh, the tedious, tedious, tedious things we do to make our journals. <laughs> but I love it. I think because you have to stay focused, and that's what I like about it, is, you know, it um, kind of keeps me distracted from other worldly things, you know. Definitely helps me stay focused with other stuff, so. So I'm not thinking about other stuff, which I like. All right, so. And I kind of don't want the bottom tacked down. I want it to be kind of freely lacy. There, and yes, I know I tacked all the way to the top, but I would much rather use a little more glue and make sure it is covered and not enough. <laughs> and then it falls off. So, all right, I think now what I want to do is mm, run a stitch all the way around to hold it in place, obviously. Um, because at least if this piece comes off, I've got, you know, it's not going to fall off, obviously. So, all right, let me go run this into the machine and see where we're sitting. Okay. Well, I sure am glad I didn't video that because I think my marbles moved from my mouth back up to my brain because I broke two needles before I finally figured out I had the wrong needle in there. <laughs> Because I've been sewing on fabric, making the 
the zipper pouch so I, I use a smaller you know needle intended for um, fabric and then when I sew on paper and stuff and lace and stuff I'll use like a leather one so that way I can sew through thinner or thicker paper and not have any issues so yeah that would have made an interesting of course you guys would have got a good laugh out of it and I think the Super Bowl has begun because my dogs are barking because somebody's shooting off fireworks so <laughs> oh, crazy things they do here in Missouri I got uh, one neighbor he is a huge Chiefs fan and um, He's got all his stuff out, all his flags, his cars all decked out. <laughs> Just like, really? I mean, but, you know, everybody has their, their hobby and their likes and stuff. So, who am I? Who am I to say? So, okay. So now, I want to close. I want to. Seal this up. So, just gonna seal right above the stitch line there. And that side. Ooh, we don't want any glue in the middle there. Come on, Mr. Faber Tech. We don't need to be all stringy today. And there. Come on. Make sure I don't have any glue there because I don't want it sticking together. And then we're just going to close, seal her up. Very, very simple stuff to do. And then, and then, <laughs> I think that's from another movie. I can't remember what. <laughs> one of those weird movies okay so then I want to glue this to this end and then see we have like a nice little pouch in here to put cards or envelopes or little notes or scraps or something in there and I wanted to leave this because I don't want it glued down anywhere all right so Alright, see if I can one-handedly open this. <laughs> talent. <laughs> it takes talent. Oh, see? Oh, it's okay. Monkey, it's okay. It's okay. Sorry, hold on just a moment. They get a little anxious. Okay, sorry about that. It takes a few minutes. They get very, um, 4th of July is, uh, and uh, New Year's around here is um, anxiety city with these two. <laughs> they do not like uh, the fireworks, the big bangs. And that is, okay, let me, before I do this, I want to make sure, okay, yes, it is right side up. Okay, it's upside down right now because the page is upside down, but... Um, oh, Zachary's home. Go see Zach. Go see Zach. He'll hopefully keep him calm so I can get this done. Yeah. Like I said, Super Bowl must have kicked off. <laughs> I do live in, you know, wool. America. <laughs> so, you know, people get excited over some of the craziest and smallest stuff here. Of course, you know, with the, it being the Chiefs, everybody is just ecstatic because I guess they got, uh, from what I understand, they got knocked out last year um, because of the Patriots, which my sister, they moved up to um, 
New Hampshire and her husband's a big Patriots fan. So now she is a Patriots fan. <laughs> and so, of course, you know, I think she was kind of gunning for the Chiefs, but she didn't care either way because, you know, in her house, if one or the other won, it, you know, they'd be happy. So, but, yeah. Okay, so now we have this beautiful little lacy pocket here. Ah, oh, where is my signature and I will probably fill it with something I'm sure I've got a couple little envelopes or something I could stick in there okay we want that little piece of lace to be on that side and so now we get this nice little flip out little pocket in here we can put some stuff in yay and it's so pretty so that's that. I think that's about it as far as decorating. I might have a few little extra little bits and bobs I might put in there. I'll probably do those off camera because I want to go ahead and get these sewn in and get everything done so that the journal is ready to go up, do the flip through and ready to go into my Etsy. Um, so thanks guys and I hope you're, if you're watching the Super Bowl, your team wins. Because, like I said, I'm impartial to any of it. Um, <laughs> so I wish you guys all all good luck, whoever, whoever you're rooting for. Um, and until next time, guys, plenty of hugs, loves, and blessings. Mwah. Bye.